in 2013, when Haiyan struck, we had never seen anything like it before. The city was practically 80% devastated. More than 6,000 people died in, in this horrific, catastrophic, natural disaster. And millions were left without housing. Fortunately, we met Ms. Shawnee Henry, who had this vision of having a sustainable community. As a Filipino-American, I knew I had to do something. I reached out to my association and asked for assistance. Shoney came to me when I was president and said, Steve, these people need help. And they were very responsive. And it's natural to name it the Realtor Village. These houses are built out of old shipping containers. A Filipino engineer decided we could create two bedrooms on the first floor and a bathroom and then go upstairs and do a kitchen and living quarters. We're building four units right now, and all in all, we'll be building 65 units. Salamat kayo sa naghatag ani among balay nga bag-o. Salamat kayo daghan jud kayo salamat. These are people that they hold their families together even as the homes around them are falling apart. And for uh, the National Association to be able to put that many homes back together and that many families back together was really, it was, it was very cool. Each of these homes cost $10,000 to build. $10,000, that's a lot of money for uh, any of us personally. But the generosity that I know is in the realtor's heart, we can do this over the next few years. It is our business to help people attain their dream of home ownership. And it's fitting for NAR and its members to give back in times like this. It gives people a home, it gives people hope, and it gives them peace. And hopefully that peace will be something that the realtors can build and spread, not only in the Philippines, but literally throughout the world. <laughs>